Hello everyone, this is John. This is just a, a quick little video for you guys who ask me what a 7 day event is. Uh, what's, why is that a perfect event for everything? Why Why do you? Why must you save to recharge? Uh, that's because St. Pa Patrick's Day is a 7 day event. It looks like this. You guys have probably seen it before. Uh, this style of event. So if it would load I would uh, show you guys. Uh, this is a 7 day event. You guys ask what a 7 day event. This is a 7 day event. You buy these things uh, for diamonds uh, and then you spin. Although I always do price times 5. That's my advice at least. And they have usually that in mall as well so you can, you can buy that. That's actually a damn good deal. <laughs> and uh, where you buy them? You buy them here. If you consume topaz or recharge any amount, you can buy a lot of them. And when you spin them, you can get a pot of gold. Uh, I have I have already gotten a few pot of gold. Uh, I've gotten ten of them, and I did ten price times five two times, uh, and I did that for free. I didn't recharge to do that. Um, so yeah, uh, <laughs> there 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 you go. And what you can use those for. Uh, for you guys wanting emerald suit or healing outfit, uh, you can use it for. Uh, where is it? Here, emerald shard chest wings or outfit. You only need one of them to get the best skill. Uh, so if you want clothing, for example, you get 20 of those and you have yourself a set, and that's 40 pot of gold. The, as I said, this is a seven-day event usually. Well, six day, seven day. And you should get in a pot of gold for free, at least to get close to it if you can't get the full outfit by then. And these guys are easy to get enough of. So that's what a 7 day event is and you can buy a lot of a lot of outfits here. You can buy a, a ton of outfits. So yeah, uh, <laughs> this is a very good event for everything like that. It's also a very good event if you want an artifact relic for almost free. Uh, you can probably get 90 of those by recharging 400 topaz for a few days and then you can probably get enough quite actually very easily. You can even get it for free if you're lucky to get an artifact relic pack. So if you guys wanted an arti yellow relic then that's where you can go and uh, they all always have a lot of outfits in this tycoon. <laughs> tycoon like uh, thing things. And here it's also very useful if you ha if you don't want any clothing or anything like that. This is extremely good for resources. Uh, imagine you win ten. I I won ten of these, uh, right? And just uh, and just ten of those. I managed to buy five hundred astro ingots just from that easily. So I managed to upgrade my Pamela a little bit, which I will get into just showing you guys after this. And it's super good for sunstones as well. 10 sunstones for that. 100 for 30 of those. That's actually an alright deal. And you, same with here. You can buy a lot of everything. A ton of everything. Absolutely everything you could want. Except for runestone resources. And here as well. You can get a lot of primal crystals. I wouldn't say that's the best deal. But it's an alright deal if you really need primal crystals. This is also very useful, very cheap, very very cheap to get Mystic Soul Arm sh shards. And same with Mystic Hero Supplies and Mythic Pet Shards. Uh, it's very good for Pet Awakening stuff, but I wouldn't say it's worth it for that. Not that either, probably. Relic Crystals? Yeah, 30. 30 for 60 is actually a decent deal, very good deal. Uh, this is also a decent deal, that's a very good deal by the way for runes, if you need runes. Um, as for here, yeah, you can buy some outfits for just these guys, so you can get that for free. That's what that's what I did on my Let's Play account. Sun Fury chest, even without having used any of those. The legendary pet shard chest is also amazing. Uh, very, they have a lot of good deals here. So if you want to recharge now, you can recharge 800 and uh, 400, or just 800, and then you can buy everything here. And you will be good for a life, and then you can spend topaz to buy even more. Then you get to get these guys from recharging as well. 
uh, you shouldn't recharge 12k for so 10 of those so if, you, if that's your only goal <laughs> um, but yeah that's that's a seven day event for you that's a seasonal event for example St. Patrick's Day that's a seasonal event uh, Valentine's event was a seasonal event and Christmas event was a seasonal event and Halloween was a seasonal event Lunar New Year was a seasonal event so that's what a 7 day event is. This is the best event you can have. This is the best event which exists for right now. It's the best event ever. It, it's better than all events. It's just it's just a great event, alright? It's better than every event. That's fantastic for Tycoon. And all that stuff as well. And just for all, gen all resources in general. It's really worth paying 800 topas a day to get everything you can. Absolutely everything you can from uh, uh, these uh, lucky hand, hand, hand or kiffs. So I guess I can show you guys what I did for my Pam. Then I will show her after. I made a uh, runestone plus six. Now I'm working on uh, higher plus seven. It will take me how much was it? Eight days, I think. Eight days? Question mark. Um, well, I need twelve, so six days. Six days. It should take six days from now. Uh, from tomorrow, like tomorrow is day one, and then six days from there, so seven days from today. Uh, it's still transmuted, street went crazy and got it to our level eight. And I did something interesting here um, with my new points. Actually, didn't activate something. What did I forget to activate? Oh, I forgot to activate that, I guess. Yeah, <coughs> scratch that. Uh, Alright, so. I got this, then I went for hit rate, I will show you guys why. I also went for a dodge rate as usual, I went for a crit rate, and I went for this. This gave a lot more better rating than attack would. It's it's better than attack from what I've seen. Um, so yeah, I went for that. Uh, so what I did for my Pamela, you know a lot of Pamela's have a lot of dodge rate, for example Slipknot is a good example. His Pamela has level 10 dodge rune, level 9 HP dodge, level 9 dodge rune. For example, um, Patrika, she also has a Pamela with a lot of dodge, level 10 dodge. Um, there's there's a lot of people with dodge runes. That's my enemies right now. That that's, I have to beat. And to beat these guys, I need hit. Uh, so what I did was, I went here and I added a level 9 hit rune instead of HP. So my Pamela HP went down a good amount, but her hit rate went up. And uh, that's that's about what I did. That's why her battle, rate, her battle rating could be a lot higher, but it's what it is right now because of the hit instead of HP. Because battle rating doesn't matter. What matters is you hit the enemy. And to hit the enemy you need hit, hit rate, a lot of it. So that's why I went with this extra hit rate here, plus all the extra hit rate from the rune. So people can't dodge me, even even Lotos, uh, uh, Dora shouldn't really dodge me a lot anymore. I hope. But yeah, she she is a good example of who has a lot of dodge rate or not. If I can if I can hit her easily, then it just shows that the hit rate is worth it. Yeah, so hopefully I can show you guys real quickly here. I have no idea if I can or not. Yeah, she dodges my party, but she shouldn't dodge my Pamela, hopefully. Yeah, I hope anyway. Uh, let's see, yeah, no dodging from there. Yeah, my Pamela dodged that, luckily. Hopefully that Myra won't do a rage kill again. Please, uh, yeah, she is immune to that. Oh man, my Pamela is stunned. I just wanted to show my hitting uh, her Dora. Yeah, this is taking a little while, I guess. <laughs> yeah, there we go. Let's see. She actually dodged once, but 
he might have dodged twice. I, I don't even know. I just think hit right is useful against enemies with a lot of dodge. I would show you guys, but it's kind of it's kind of difficult to find enemies um, in battle royale because I'm such a lower battle rating, so I get easy enemies. But anyway, I think it's worth it. I think it's definitely worth having hit right, especially against people like Patrika and whatnot. Um, and just having hit rate in general is, I think, a good idea. Even though my Pamela HP went down a good amount, I think it's, I think it's worth it in the end. Hopefully, <laughs> I hope. Uh, other than that, I want to thank everyone for watching. This is a seven-day event, and uh, yeah, uh, goodbye and see you. Have fun.